Hi everyone, Malibu Sean Bateman here again, and welcome to another episode on of on the on the air. And this up episode, I'm going to talk about the follow the sequel, actually the se second album done by the Fine Young Cannibals. They're on a cook, and it's a pretty good album. And on this album, they have two singles that I know of, called Good Thing and She Drives Me Crazy. And this album is pure 80s awesomeness for a band that first album had a cover of an other song. But this is, and this album is pretty good for if you're a big fan of 80s music. And... Some of these songs that I like that kind of, kind of fits my mood when I'm in a bad mood. Mood like when when my favorite team loses, I like to hear "It's Okay," uh, "It's All Right," or "And Don't Let It Get You Down." Back to back, so that I can relax, try to be in a good mood. And hell, if I cannot, if my one of my teams wins in overtime, I'll play good thing. And hell, if you if you're a big fan of, like I said, '80s music, find this album, enjoy it, and it's a pretty good album if you are into, like I said, '80s music. But in hell. I used to have their first album a few years ago, and they have a the a cover of another song called "Suspicious Minds," and they actually remix it to another and call it "Suspicious Minds," the "Suspicious Mix," and this is what the other co album looks like, "The Finding Candles," and it's and that album is a pretty good album as well, so. I'm gonna call it, give this album out of five a nice hearty four out of five, which is pretty generous. Unlike some album people giving this album some some bad ratings, some give it a little higher than I am. This is Malibu Sean Bateman signing off.